Yeah, it was, it was good, man. We just knew what we needed to do, keep doing the right things, and the goal will come. Just talk us through it. Uh, through what the goal. Mm. Uh, I think Wolf passed me the ball, shot, scored. <laughs> <laughs> nice and brief. But it, it was a, it was a moment that that captured the game, that won the game. And what's the feeling like when the ball does hit the back of the net? It was a good feeling. Do you feel you deserved it overall? Yeah. What did you think was the best bit about the performance today? Uh, everything, just the way we battled, the way we passed the ball, the way we pressed, everything about the game was... Guys, <laughs> you know, I've never seen any called interview like that. Michael Olis is really a called killer. <laughs> and when he scores, he doesn't celebrate. He's like, this is a normal, a normal day in the office. You know, I'm just doing my job. When the post guy come at your home and drop some mails do you say thank you or do you see do you see him celebrate <laughs> that what he said after scoring that amazing free kick the last minute against manchester united so we got him people michael olise to chelsea football club it's a here we go not like official official but many many Big outlet, they're talking about it. Sky Sport, L'Equipe in France, RMC, Fabrizio Romano, Ben Jacobs, you know, David Austin. So get your champagne ready because he will be holding the shirt very, very soon. Wow, wow, wow. What a crazy window it's been for Chelsea Football Club, man. <laughs> And for people who are worried about the financial fair play, Chelsea are going to spend $1 billion. Listen, I just made a video. You know, I took some compilation of people who really know about money and transfers. So I am going to leave the link at the end of this video so you understand that Chelsea is still on the green. And we still have more than 12 months until the next financial cycle is over and in between we can still sell a lot of players and we should be fine so people are throwing numbers out there just to make chelsea looks like uh, they are cheating the system but listen man we are just smart and we are doing good business so look at this chelsea have activated 35 million release clause and this is from mr fabrizio romano right into michael olise's contract deal advancing to final stages close has always been there despite denials and all parties will be in touch to finalize the agreement olise already said yes to chelsea time to fix details wow 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 somebody need to stop todd boyley that brother is on some kind of <laughs> smoke <laughs> he's not real we are frustrating everybody around the world right now <laughs> we're just being smart so welcome back home i'm not gonna say welcome welcome back because he's been here in the academy one of us through and through from cobham so unfinished business he's coming to cook i can't wait man if you told me at the beginning of this window that we were going to end up by jackson michael axel disassi you know people like that i want I, I was never going to believe you but now it's reality people and people really need to take us seriously now i believe what Pochettino said that now we have to aim for the big price. We are not going to be just, you know, doing good. We have to challenge for something this season, no matter what. And that is the spirit that Pochettino really want 
<sighs> Chelsea to implement this season. Ben Jacobs, Chelsea have triggered a release close into Michael's Crystal Palace contract and now expected to complete the signing for 35 million as per Fabrice, blah, 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 blah. So what I heard is Chelsea might pay a little bit more so they can have better payment, you know, terms. But let's wait and see what's going to happen. But man, I'm so happy about this deal. Uh, came out of the blue pretty much. And man, can you imagine? We have a lot of left-footed players in our team at the moment who are very good. We have so many tricky players. Noni Madweke. Now we have Michael. And I don't know what we're going to do with uh, Jan Madsen, but that is another topic for another day. But let's just celebrate about Michael Olise to Chelsea Football Club. He can play from the midfield position, number 8 or number 10 or even a force nine, and he can play as a, as a winger. So we have another versatile player here who is going to help Chelsea cook and get ready because I'm telling you right now, we're going to be a team that nobody want to play against because you don't know. We are so unpredictable to the level of everybody is going to be afraid of us. So get ready. We might surprise many people this season. And maybe win it. Why not? Okay, so talking about another bowler. <laughs> Fabrizio Romano last uh, tweet about uh, Lavia. He says, Chelsea and Southampton closing in on Romeo Lavia move. Structure of the deal is being discussed. How to activate the add-ons and also sent ask for a bigger part of the fee up front matter of short time to get final green light and proceed with medical here we go very soon <laughs> oh, man just imagine all right romeo lavia moises caicedo and enzo fernandez in that midfield and you have a backup also. You know, who knows? You might keep Leslie. We we have to loan him out. But you know what I'm trying to say? Like, we have death. We have people who can get the job done. And I, I'm so happy. I'm, like, secured. We have a, a very good defense. We have a, good, a very good midfield. No more sideways, backwards, sideways, and blame other people. Now everybody is going to be working for everybody wow 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 get ready and i understand why people are kind of uh, afraid of chelsea you are right my friend you have to be afraid and you have to report chelsea to fifa uh un the united nations of course african cup of nations you can report you can cry say whatever you want it's not gonna change anything everything is legal chelsea still on the green and again i am going to recommend you to watch the video that i made early on i am going to leave the link in the description so you can click and watch that video and understand the basics of what todd Bowley is doing so keep the head coming but we are moving we are moving forward <laughs> so we are about to complete this deal probably by the time you watch this video something might come out and he will be holding the shirt so let's say let's hope that it's gonna happen probably on on wednesday or thursday or something as soon as possible so we can start preparing uh to cook west ham united on sunday right correct me if i'm wrong let's go <laughs> i'm getting too excited on this one Moises Caicedo, of course, I can't stop talking about this brother, man. How can you stop talking about Moises Caicedo, people? So if you're happy about the quality of this video and the time that it takes your brother to edit the video and give you a little bit different kind of product, please smash that like button, man. If you are a true Chelsea fan and now we are, we are bullying people, we are destroying everybody and getting all our targets on time, 
and you're not happy and you don't smash that like button, man, we have to transfer you. We have to send you to Tottenham Hotspurs, right? Okay, go there on loan for one year and come back next season when we win the league. <laughs> Anyways, all the jokes aside, people, help me get minimum 1,000 likes for this video. Very quickly here, what Chelsea official, this video been there, but they put together a behind the scenes kind of video if you want to watch it. I already made another video about Caicedo uh, behind the scenes. In my channel so you go there and uh, and you watch so nice to see really Caicedo home because he's a Chelsea fan since when he was a kid back in Ecuador Casadei my brother good luck we're gonna we're gonna have to to think really hard because Chelsea got the best midfield in the world right now in my opinion and you have this guy a monster Kasade, he's going to play for Leicester City in the championship. Get more experience, get more playing time, and let's see what's going to happen next season. But man, this guy is physical, powerful, very good with his head. I still remember during the preseason, he was helping us defensively uh, for corner kicks, set pieces. He always win his headers. So let's wait and see what's going to happen. Good luck to Cesar Kasade. Listen, my people, before this video get too long, I'm going to have to end it there. Expect some more videos. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Let's get minimum 1,000 likes. You guys are absolutely legend. God bless you and see you next time.